We are bringing together our sustainability network, which is a group of uh, individuals from our plants that are responsible for things like reduction of energy, water, waste, uh, CO2 emissions from our plants. We're sharing a lot of best practices for different things that other plants have done that we can improve on and learn from them to be able to help our plant. such a diverse um, business portfolio and a huge footprint for our company, it's really important that we bring our people together. You have the, the fresh eyes approach where everyone has a different viewpoint, different experiences, and then inside these experiences, you can bring a lot of value to other people. The people in this room represent over 50% of the impact in North America if you add up all their plants, which is pretty, pretty incredible. Any improvement you can make, whether you're a big site or a small site, any impact you can make, um, is helpful. We've got to save what we've got and, and make the, the earth better. It's sort of built into the DNA of our company. It's very important to Pierre-André, our, our CEO, and I think it really is just good business. Our CEO, you know, actually wrote a book on climate change. So just from that high top-level management um, support, you can tell that it's important to our company. Comfort and well-being and sustainability really create this sort of this mesh of our products and what our customers care about, what our investors care about, what our employees care about. I mean, I'm passionate about this subject. People in this room are passionate about this subject. Obviously, we care about the world that we live in and we want to make sure that we're improving it for generations to come. As an EHS manager, I'm also an environmentalist, so I want to be proud of what my company is doing. We're the largest building products company in the world. So we have a lot of impact that we can make on the built environment. St. Cobain has set us ourselves really deep into the market to be able to make these changes. And if St. Cobain starts driving the changes, others will follow.